From deep south Texas, Hidalgo is where we're at. The State Farm Arena, Patrick Sullivan would try to motivate his current team, the Austin Toros, when they would face off against his former team, the Rio Grande Valley Vipers. Tyler Honeycutt gets it from Andrew Goudlock. Honeycutt pops the three. Watch Honeycutt right here. He's going to work his way into the lane and drop a little floater on the Toros. Honeycutt would end up with a total of 17.6 rebounds and two assists on the night. All that action happening in the second quarter. Watch Aaron Baines. He will go in, miss it, get his own rebound, work his way underneath. Baines lays it up and in. Baines ends up with 23 points, 15 rebounds and two assists. Lester Hudson from downtown. Bingo. Lester Hudson, 22.7 rebounds and three assists. But the night belonged to the Rio Grande Valley Vipers. Ray Murray throws it up. Chris Daniels slams it down. And then, of course, we've got Andrew Goudluck getting into the picture. Famous for his little floaters. Watch this one. Oops. It's in. Andrew Goudluck then showing versatility from the corner. He's got a three. Andrew Goudluck would end up with 21 points, three rebounds, and seven assists. Glenn Rice Jr., Check this out, going underneath and reverse. He gets it to fall in, and Glenn Rice Jr. working his way in the paint. He's going up against Lester Hudson. Turnaround jump shot, it's good. They're dancing in Hidalgo, Texas tonight because the Vipers put up 120 points and everyone in attendance got a free fajita taco. Final score, the Rio Grande Valley Vipers 120, the Austin Toros 111. Log on to rgvipers.com. Find out when the next action, playoff style, will be right here on the NBA Development League Network.